Hello everyone. This video is sort of a little informal footnote to the previous genetics video about colours, patterns and modifiers. I've just got two groups of pigeons together so you can see the colours and patterns side by side. Hopefully it helps if you struggled to understand the previous video. Now all these birds are molting so they don't look their best but hopefully it'll still be helpful. Starting with the colour, here we have an ash red, a blue and a brown all in bar pattern. Like I said, they're still molting, so the brown still has some quite faded feathers to change from last year. The light patches aren't anything interesting, they're just his old faded feathers. This fading is pretty common with brown pigeons, and explains why brown is fairly rare in flying breeds. When they're all next to each other like this, the differences between the three base colours are fairly obvious. Of course, I've shown all these colours here in bar pattern, but each colour can be paired with all the patterns. So now let's take a look at the patterns. This time there are four pigeons, all with the blue base colour. We have barless, bar, check, and dark check, or tea check. The barless pigeon is a little lighter than the rest, but this isn't because of her pattern. It's due to some other lightning genes that she has. Unfortunately she is the only barless pigeon that I have, so I don't have a better example for you at the moment. Again, these are all blue pigeons, but the pattern can be just as easily matched with any of the base colours. You can have an ash red barless or a brown tea check, for example. That's about it for the colours and patterns. I might make a few more videos showing the similarities and differences between some of the other modifier genes as well. But I hope this quick video has uh, been helpful and helped you to understand the base colours and patterns a little more. Uh, feel free to leave any questions in the comments.